First here on Fox, caught on camera, detectives investigating a string of burglaries at restaurants on South Grand in South St. Louis. Police say early this morning, police responded to three break-ins within a block of each other. Fox News Mallory Thomas shows us more of this surveillance video of a break-in at Gotham and Eggs. Breakfast is served a little late here Friday morning. It sucks. It takes a lot of time out of our day, filing insurance claims, trying to board up a window, all the cleanup, but we didn't lose anything. Shawnee Knight owns Gotham and Eggs. She says the surveillance video shows it all. It was three young kids in hoodies, faces covered. They went straight in. One went straight through to our office through the kitchen. While one criminal goes into the office, the other two head to the computers. And I think they were expecting to find registers there, but they just like, you know, tossed around the area a little bit. They all gathered in the office, tried to pull our safe out, couldn't get it. It's bolted to the floor um, and then they bolted so like less than two minutes in and out. Just right around the block, police are investigating burglaries at Pokey One and Mocha Bees where money was stolen from both businesses. Back at Gotham and Eggs, Shawnee says this is the second break in at the restaurant since opening back in August. The first time we got hit, we posted on social media, hey, we've got our first supervillain and so this time we were like, okay, there's more villains in Gotham now. Shawnee says joking about the break-ins helps get through the day. She hopes police or someone from the community recognizes the criminals. It's not worth it at all. Most businesses don't keep cash overnight. You're just risking jail time, probation, whatever else may come along with it for nothing. In St. Louis, Mallory Thomas, Fox 2 News.